Hello there, this is Dave Allen for Mac 20 Questions and for No Stylus and all the other websites that I write for. And I've got a question in from DJ Taking It Back. And he wants to know, can I use this recording software, talking about Amadeus Pro, to record my DJ sessions? Well, he wants to be able to record from some audio in the computer and he also wants to record from an outside source. Well, if it was coming from an outside source, well, you can just plug it into the line in and do it that way. If it's going to be from the computer, then you're going to need to do a little bit of work to get this set up. And the first thing to do is to go to the Soundflower project. So if you go to the Soundflower project, you go to the downloads and download the file. This is the one that I downloaded here, 1.6.6, and I installed it and it worked fine. You will find that when you install it, you will need to do a reboot of your computer to get it working. Once you've got it working, thing to do then is to go up to your settings on your menu bar, hold down the option key and you will see where the output is sent to. Okay, so now you can see that the output device at the moment is set to go to headphones. So what you need to do is to set it go to Soundflower 2 channel. Now go to preferences and in preferences go to the sound and say that I want the input to be Soundflower. And in the output, well, I'm having it sent to my headphones uh, that I'm wearing. The headphones, when it says headphones, it actually goes to my uh, external speakers that I've got connected to the headphone port. And this one here, the C-Media USB audio device, that's a headphone that I actually use for working with Drag and Dictate. So once you've got those things set up, then you can go into your uh, Amadeus and start recording. So let's just uh, start a recording here, and I'm going to... Click on that there. And nothing's happening at the moment because it's not playing anything. So now if I go into this here and start this playing, so let's just click on play. And I can actually hear that through my headphone now because I've got this button here uh, where it says play through ticked. And so I can hear what it's actually saying. If you don't have that tick there, you won't hear anything at all. So you see from these uh, level meter here that it is actually doing some recording. And once I get the recording that I want to, I can click on stop and have a look and see what we've got. So let's just do that now. I'll go back into this here and I can press pause on that there as well. So you can see here we've got uh, the how recording. Now obviously that first bit there, we've got uh, no recordings in there because I haven't got it started. So we can chop that out there and then we can start playing this through. I can actually hear that playing through my headphone. Well, that's how you do it. It's pretty easy, really, isn't it? So now you've got some sound output that you're coming in from somewhere else. Then obviously all you need to do is to add another track. So let's add a new stereo track. And then you can have another recording coming in on this stereo track and mix them together as you see fit. So this is Dave Allen from Mac 20 Questions, and that's how you can use Amadeus Pro to record audio from your computer directly into Amadeus. Bye-bye now. Thanks for watching the video and why don't you check out the other videos, here's two of them. There's one video there and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon, bye bye now.